Hey everyone, welcome to a, another edition of Peanut Opens, his super chewer box from BarkBox. This is the box from BarkBox that uh, is for those dogs that just have to tear through everything. They usually come with uh, two treats, two edible like stick treats, and a couple of toys. I'm not sure what this month's theme is. This should be the April box. I'm hoping it's the April box and I didn't mix it up with the May box. I'm pretty sure I've said this before. I am so far behind on opening his boxes. He's got toys that he doesn't even know he's got. Poor baby. Now let's get started. Oh, look at that. Look at that cute doggo. What's he playing with? I wonder if that's the toy that's in here. Oh my goodness, it is. And he is immediately excited and trying to eat stuff. What is it? Oh yeah, you want it? You want it? Tell the camera how much you want it. You want it? You want it? He wants it. So let's see, what do we got in here? Sorry, I put my finger right on the camera. Chewberry Gardens. It's a magic garden full of cute little critters and precious plants who simply can't wait to get clobbered and slobbered on by your dog. Hey, better our garden than yours. Do us a favor and make sure your dog does their business outside. Our plants are already plenty fertilized. Hardy har har. So up top, this looks like a, 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 a is it a frog? Is it a cactus? I guess it's like a frog. Yeah, that's a frog. Now that I see it this way, with the red thing, that's definitely a frog. Um, I don't know if this is for carrying or tugging. Um, he wants it. I mean, I'm gonna put it down, but he's probably gonna steal it. And off he goes. No, <laughs> not off he goes. We got uh, stick number one. I usually feed these to him in the video. Uh, this one is chicken recipe, dog chew. It's a, it's pretty thin. Um, it's actually not as long as the package. Like this right here, this little bit is just air. He will probably get that. Then there's the other stick. It is a pumpkin and honey recipe. This one feels a little bit thicker maybe. But there's not actually a window on this one to really see inside the treat. Oh, we got a, a flower! Flower power! Oh, yeah. It's so cute. It's like a little daisy. Let's see. Paw and jaw. Easy for your dog to grab, grip, and chew. Solid nylon. Chewing can get rough. Sand this toy down if you start to see edges. Are you running away with the treats? <laughs> butter scent, because everything, even a flower, is better with butter. Dishwasher safe, top rack only. Look at how happy this pup is. Hopefully my pup is that happy too. <laughs> then we got bags of treats. Uh, looks like jerky sticks, chicken recipe. Um... 70% USA chicken, sweet potato, wholesome grains. We'll get him to try one of these. These are like perfect for like, you know, good boy outside. And what's this other bag? Soft bakes. Uh, duck and veggie recipe. These look like cookies. Like, like, or granola? Like cookie, granola? <laughs> I mean, you know. <laughs> Oh, I can't, I can barely read this packaging. Like, the, it's white font on, like, this light beige color. Um, I'm not a fan. <laughs> Let's see what it says. Are your dog's paws tap dancing at record speed? That's what happens when they chow down on our scrumptious soft baked biscuits. Oh, they're biscuits. Well, that answers that debate, I guess. Made with cage-free duck and loaded with wholesome veggies. This recipe was approved by board certified nutritionists and taste tested by our most trusted experts, our dogs. What else we got? Oh, this is the tag. So this is a uh, tug tied toad. It's not a frog, it's a toad. He wants to play with the tag. Are you serious, man? 
Reinforced nylon strap, great for tug, fetch, and thrashing, and catching flies if you're lucky. Spot clean only, do not use in the dishwasher, not friendly. Unique texture for satisfying chewing. Natural rubber and squeaker. Oh no, not a squeaker. Not a squeaker. So let's see. Oh no. This one it looks like some sort of gnome was one of the options. Uh, that looks like peas in a pod. And there was like some sort of purpley thing. I mean, he will enjoy these toys no matter what. Hopefully. Bitening bug was another was another one. Bitening bug. <laughs> Pretty interesting to see the uh, other toys that could have come this month. Again, I believe this is the April box. Um, I have May and June on my table, so we gotta get moving. <laughs> <laughs> we're so behind. All right, we're gonna supervise him eating this. Oh gosh, we're gonna supervise him eating this chicken stick. It's upside down. They really are soft, like, definitely like a cookie or something. I think he inhaled it. Oh wait, no. No inhaling. Where you going? You want a jerky stick? We got jerky stick. Don't worry guys, these are really the only treats he's had all day. <laughs> Try that. I don't know what that tag is on the floor over there. Of course there's a tag on the floor. Did you eat it? Dude, you need to like savor your food a little bit better. My goodness. No wonder you act like you're starving all the time. All right, let's see if we can get him to play with this. Here. He doesn't want to. And he immediately is trying to get the nylon off.
Wow, look what you did. Man, that's not gonna last long. I think it's time. No! Oh, he ripped it off. You ripped it off. It doesn't have a tongue anymore. I'm definitely gonna. Excuse me. Well then, I'm definitely gonna have to finish um, getting that off for him. Or he's just gonna chew it right off, man. What are you doing? These pieces are going in the garbage. No, you. You lost the privilege privilege of having them.
well, um, I'm actually rather impressed with this box, I must say. He actually played with both toys for quite a bit. And then he started licking his paw, so I think he's uh, saying that's a good point to cut off. Um, the toys in this box are pretty cute. Um, he ripped the frog's tongue off, but we just, you know, rip toad. And uh, the daisy's pretty cute too, he seems to like it. It's definitely serving its purpose. He seems to like both of the treats, but that doesn't surprise me. You know, he's very food motivated. So, uh, until next time. Peanut, you want to say bye? Look at how cute he is! You say bye? Okay, bye!